I got to get into the behind the scenes story of a bride who married a duh, duh, the dummy. Christine and Gannon Carmeyer were all set up to have this beautiful wedding day. They had the wedding venue set up in advance and they were getting ready to walk down the aisle and cut cake. And Christine, the bride, she was getting herself ready. And her husband Gannon had nothing better to do than to get food poisoning on the morning of their wedding, okay? So he couldn't even attend. He was in the hospital. Um, he had to be rushed to the emergency room and it was a complete disaster. So what does she do? She gets married and has a ceremony, dances, cuts cake, does it all with a mannequin. That's right, girl. Hold on to your man, Nikin, the best way you can. The venue, the Victorian in Youngsville, North Carolina, apparently set up this kind of makeshift mannequin groom. They put a pole on some type of rolling device. They dress the pole up in groom's clothing, like a tuxedo or something like that. And then they fixed some kind of tablet on top and they plastered her husband Gannon's face on it. Now he was in the hospital, not feeling good. So he couldn't even be on screen like FaceTimed or Skyped in. They actually had to just use a picture of him. And that was her husband for the day. That was her groom. And it was super cute. The video of them slow dancing and cutting cake and taking pictures with wedding guests actually went viral all over TikTok. So many people were really supportive of the movement, but then there was some haters. People in the comments definitely dragged Christine for not being at the hospital with her husband. They were like, you know, what happened to the through sickness and health deal? Like you're not there with them. You're out having a party with your friends and a mannequin. If it was me, I would probably still have the party. Assuming he wanted that, I would probably, you know, defer like, oh no, Demure, I, I want to stay with you, honey. But if he said, no, Asia, go, go to the party and enjoy, turn up, dance with mom and dad. Listen, I'm going to dance in limbo and do it all. I'm a twerker from way back. I'm sure that's why my husband picked me in the first place. I think that I need to be twerking on a wedding day rather than, you know, stuck in a hospital waiting room or even the parking lot because with COVID, you don't even know if you can go upstairs. You know, it seemed like she and the wedding guest and the mannequin had the time of their lives. And Gannon actually commented in the TikTok comments that he was very appreciative of uh, the Victorian for kind of making their day into a celebration rather than something to cry about. He was glad that Christine went to the wedding. He didn't want her to have to sit in the hospital. They already had friends and family coming to the venue and um, he much rather her be there turning up, celebrating their union than sitting there in a hospital a lot of people were super supportive of that. They were like, listen, don't let your husband stand in the way of a good time. Don't let your husband ruin your wedding day. And she sure didn't. She made sure she had her groom, even if it really was, you know, an upgraded broomstick on wheels. <laughs>